lovies? It's me, Mrs. T. Wow, that was really high pitch, wasn't it? <laughs> it's me, Hi, Mrs. T. And this is Mr. EJ, formerly known as a teenager, but he is no longer a teenager. So yeah, that's a whole nother story. And he's sitting in with me because I finally received my R Riveter box. Now, you guys know that I am a brand ambassador for R Riveter. And we have like competitions within or amongst the other brand ambassadors and I won one Which is why I have this box, but the catch 22 to this is I won for my content Which was the videos that I did I'll link them down below or I'll post them in here somewhere um, About why I like being a brand ambassador and also the two videos I did an unboxing and how to use the keychain so I won for those as well as a couple of blog posts and I've been stalking him to go check my mailbox and that's why he's kind of sitting in because I've literally been stalking him checking my mailbox for like two weeks and it finally came. Now, I don't know what's in here though. We won a prize, but they would not tell us what we actually won. Now, I told them what I would like, but judging by the size of the box, <laughs> I'm no, I don't think it's what I wanted. I mean, I want anything they give me, but I don't think it's the one I was thinking it was because the box is kind of small. But let's see what it is. So, as you can see, it is taped up. He literally just brought it to me. Scissors. And we're going to open. So, let's see what it is. Is there more tape? Yes, there's yes. more tape. Like grandma taped it. Yeah, they did a lot of tape. Oh, okay. I told you. All right, so we're open. Let me let you go. I still can't get in it. It's because it's we're still taped up. Open it, is it? It's still taped oh. up. <laughs> Goodness, Riveter. You didn't want me to get in? Not only did you surprise me, but you didn't really want me to get in this box, apparently. All right. There you go. That's a lot for the box. Oh, my goodness gracious. It's like a jigsaw puzzle. We're just going to open it this way. Ta-da. So... Ta-da. I don't think it's a cut. Now, if you guys saw my videos, you know that I have the auto generation three. Oh, it is green. <laughs> um, I have the auto generation three and I also have the camel colored like zipper. That's a clutch, I think. Zipper wristlet. It's not a clutch, it's a wristlet. Wristlet. So he just spotted clutch. that this is green. It is a little bit bigger than a clutch. I have a feeling it is either the patent or the hobby, but I think it's the patent because the hobby tends to be a little bit bigger than it. But first, let me show you. They sent me more cards for me to continue my ambassadorship stuff. Paper off. Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? The ambassadorship stuff. Yeah, you know. It's green. This is the patent. So the hobby is bigger, so this has to be the patent. Oh. Okay, guys, I'm not completely disappointed because I did kind of want... This is a crossbody bag. And it's, it? yeah, it's the army green with black. This is from the winter collection. Yeah, it, there's the, the strap is inside. So oh. this is the patent and it's in the... They're not calling this army green. It's called Riverside, I believe. I was going to say. Don't test that's... me on this, but I think it's Riverside. <laughs> I think it's Riverside. I'll make sure and double check. I'll even send you, I'll put it down below. But it's black with the green. And that's the inside. It is a Gen 3. Stripes. Stripes, right? And then here's the R Riveter ID patch. I think this is so cool that you can always track down exactly who made your bag. The tags are probably inside. Here's the strap. So it is a crossbody. Okay, people, I'm not completely disappointed. Not completely. And I'm not going to tell you. Did I mention which one I wanted? I'm not going to tell you which one I wanted. Just in case I still win that one later on down the line. You know. So let's just. Shh, shh, we won't say anything about that one. Okay, I'm shit. so happy about this one. No, I am happy about this one. Because I did. I do love crossbody bags. And it's a, it's a really good size. Like you can still sit. Fit. Fit. Sit. A full size. Um, oh, I don't see the tags. Let me check the zipper part before I say that. But I, you can still fit a full-size wallet, like checkbook-size wallet in here. So it's a good size. No, yeah, I don't. Oh, you know why? Duh. You don't need the tags. These are the tags I was looking for. And yes, I keep my tags for my bags. I'm just kind of weird like this. But these are the tags I was talking about. Because these usually tell you who did it and everything. And they were on the larger bags. But 
done for the pat and this is one of them so my r r can you see you probably can't see i'll just tell you cool. was r r 102 look i know i see that part and then for the patents and probably the hobby i'm trying to do this and show you the inside they actually show it there so you don't need the tag a dirt dirt to me so this one my liner was made by rr074 or r riveter 074 and the assembly was rr068 and the quality control check was done by rr147 so it says each river id is a maker with a story so i can literally take these ids one two three four ids and go to rriveter.com and I can actually look up who made my purse. I can know whether it came from Fort Bragg or Fort Hood or whatever other military installation, army installation that our Fort Bragg, our, our Riveters work at. And yeah, I know I messed up, whatever. And here is my, the, the what are they? Dog tags that I love because they tell you when you're, this glare is ridiculous. It was made yeah, even... and it's 2017. <laughs> and then my riveter for this tag was RR024. And look, that's five riveters, right? And then here is RR150. Can you see that stamp? So that's how many? Um, Six. Look right there. Oh, well, did you get that one? Yeah, so one, two, right? Three, four, five, six six riveters so far helped put together this bag and that's the amazingness about our riveter each part of the bag is made by a different assembly person or a different riveter and so no one bag has one creator or one person who played a role in it they all play a part and it's like i love i love their teamwork makes the dream work, teamwork makes the dream work. yes so that's this bag on that's how bags on a mission works there's so many different people and so many different hands that go into making such a really super quality bag. And so this was my prize, people. And you guys helped me get there by watching my videos, reading my posts, showing your support, purchasing your own Riveter bag. So be sure to keep doing that because I am going to be an ambassador for 2018. You're going to see a lot more content coming out. And I can't wait to work and wear this and style this and i might wear it today i don't know i got pink and gray on for valentine so maybe i'll wear it tomorrow i'm not sure but i am happy with my gift my prize my surprise because they totally got me with this one i'm happy with it and i like the green so thanks our riveter and i'll see you guys next video say bye bye have a great time